In this short video I'll be testing the HM71R head torch by Phoenix Lights. I would like to say thanks to one of my subscriber friends and Phoenix for getting this across to me. I will start with the main specs of the torch which can be found on the Phoenix website. This screen shows the lumen output for each setting. The torch itself is made from high strength aluminium and is also IP68 water and dust rated and 2 meter drop impact testified. When I opened this torch I saw it was powered by a much larger battery than I am used to, having only used 18650 batteries to this day. This head torch is rechargeable at just 4 hours with a USB-C cable connector which is found underneath the rubber seal at the back of the torch. I have unclipped the torch from the head strap for a demonstration but when connecting it back the clip slides in until it clicks and I noticed it doesn't have any excess movement when it's attached. One click of the button at the top shows the battery levels. Solid green is 80 to 100%, flashing green is 50 to 80, solid red is 20 to 50 and flashing red is 1 to 20%. To activate the spotlight you hold the button in for a couple of seconds. Each click afterwards goes through each of the four light modes, low, medium, high and turbo mode. To activate the floodlight, double click the button and click again to cycle through the light modes. If you hold the button in whilst on the floodlight setting, it will automatically switch back to the spotlight setting and hold it again to turn off the torch. When in turbo mode, the LED lens gets very hot as I found out during testing. Another good feature of this torch is the bottom is magnetic, so it can be placed on surfaces for working or in my case for photography lighting. So for this test I visited a local village road with no street lighting and I tested only the brightest settings and I'm very pleased with the performance of this torch, it will definitely brighten up my future videos. So I will end this video by saying thanks again to Phoenix for sending this out to me to try. I will be using it in all future videos so thank you for watching and the link to the torch is in the description below.